The drawing canvas that is available in Word 2007 helps you create and assemble different drawing objects. The drawing canvas also provides a boundary between your drawing and the text on the page. You can draw both simple shapes such as lines and circles and complicated shapes such as stars and arrows. When you hold down the shift key as you draw and then release the mouse button before releasing the shift key, Word 2007 creates objects of equal height and width. You can change the size and shape of an object by dragging the sizing handles of the object. You can copy an object by holding down the control key and then by dragging the copy of the object to the required location. You can fill a selected object with a color that you want. In addition, you can modify the color, thickness, and style of the border around the object and the shadow effect behind the object. The gallery in the Insert Shapes group on the Format tab contains various shapes that you can insert in your document. Available shapes include lines, block arrows, flowcharts, and callouts. When you are drawing a curve, after you click the location where you want your drawing to begin, the location of every subsequent click determines the edges of the curve. After the curve suits your requirements, double-click the drawing canvas. When you group two or more objects, the group becomes a new object. Grouped objects maintain their positions relative to one another. You can rotate or flip shapes individually or as a group of objects. While an object is selected, you can move the object by using the arrow keys. At any time, you can resize the drawing canvas. Resizing the drawing canvas changes the size of the objects proportionately. You can use the buttons in the Arrange group to change the placement of the drawing canvas relative to the text. By default, when you insert a picture within text, the arrangement of the text changes. You can use the options on the Advanced Layout dialog box to change the text wrapping style and location of the picture. You can change the position of a picture by modifying the settings on the Picture Position tab in the Advanced Layout dialog box. When you change the wrapping style of a picture to tight, the associated text wraps around the edges of the picture. Notice that changing the wrapping style of the pictures to tight moves the pictures to the first page of the document. The order in which you insert pictures initially determines the stacking of the pictures. You can change the stacking order by selecting a picture and clicking the Bring to Front or send to back button in the arrange group to move the picture to the top or bottom of the stack. 